So my message today is for somebody who's constantly being bombarded by messages saying that, you know, people are burnt out, nursing is toxic, and you shouldn't even consider a career in this field. First of all, I need to put this disclaimer out there. Burnout is real, and people are literally at the breaking point wanting to leave the bedside and go do something else. Now that we got that out of the way, let me address something. The reason why you keep seeing all these messages is because it causes engagement. And these platforms will keep pushing it out there so that people are engaged. Essentially, it's like a confirmation of bias. If you believe something is, you know, negative, you come onto this platform and then you find something talking about how negative that thing is, it just confirmed what you thought it was. And the more you engage with that kind of content, the more that content is then pushed right back to you. But there is a small group of nurses out there who have figured out the algorithm and will continue telling you that, oh, we are burnt out. This crap is, you know, this is all toxic. And they know that you're going to click on that and watch their videos all the way because their content is engaging. Yet at the same time, they haven't given up their licenses. Why is that? In fact, I just want to ask them this question. Are you really burnt out? Because for the right amount of money, you will walk your ass right back over to that bedside and do what needs to be done. So let me ask you again. Are you really burnt out? Or are you just trying to say that you're tired of organizations not paying you the right amount of money? So instead of feeding this nonsense as far as burnout is concerned, when there are true nurses who are truly burnt out and need help, why don't you put out messages like, hey, nursing is great. However, let me set you with, you know, let me help you with some real, have some realistic expectations when you come into this career field. It is not going to be a bed of roses. You're probably going to lose, you know, sleep. You're going to be frustrated. You're going to be tired. You're going to be, you know, have high anxiety states. But once you graduate and actually get to the floor, if you come into that position with those expectations already set, you want to be disappointed. And if you find that that bedside nursing is not something that you want to do, you can then decide, I want to take my license and, you know, do something in management. Do something with an insurance company. Work for a law firm. You know, work with, you know, with uh, software. You know, go do informatics. There is so much nursing can do. So let's encourage people to come into this field, but set realistic expectations. Anyway, y'all have a good day.